already 6.30, you know. Don't you have cram school tonight? Not now, Mom. I just killed someone. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, and welcome to Will the Scry. We got the homie, the pleasure of inviting Jay Imprex to the What's channel. Good, y'all? First episode, starting here, if you watched our opening reaction where we talked about the the three different animes that we put forward, I believe it was it was Demon Slayer, it was Attack on Titan, it was Death Note, and Jay Imprex really liked the sound of Death Note. I'm really glad he did. It's such a great intro to someone like Jay Imprex who has not really dabbled in anime and how actually spectacular it is. A lot of people from the outside think it's, you know, nerdy because of all the weeb shit and it often it often leaves um, the the really beautiful storytelling and really intelligent smart like honestly like jay and bricks i can't talk about enough like these people over in japan are the smartest people the best storytellers i've ever seen in my life and this is a great great show to kind of encapsulate that um so with that being said we're gonna jump into episode one here is there anything you want to add jay before we actually just hop into the content uh no i'm ready Let's yeah get started all right, let's do this thing. And just so everyone knows, even though the channel is primarily, you know, sub because we all like the voice actor and stuff like that, I, I was explaining to Jay that Death Note is like the one, one of the few exceptions to the rule because the voice acting in English isn't that bad. It's it's actually what I watched when I was watching this on Toonami back in the day. Um, and and it doesn't take away Let from the experience. You. Yeah. Let me pause you. Yeah. This is that old? Toonami? Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah, this is oh like... I was thinking this is like a recent show that has came out. No, out of the ones I was talking about, so Attack on Titan was like 2010 when that blew up. Okay. Death Note was like probably like 2007-ish that ran into like 2012-ish, I think. Something mm -hmm. like that. So it's it's a while ago, but there's a reason it's still like held in the pantheons of the all-time greats. Oh, now, all right, now I'm even more excited. <laughs> Dope. So we are going to be watching it in dub, but um, I think it actually is really great for someone who's trying to experience the world of, you know, anime for the first time. And Let's jump right in. I am Kirk D. Cam. This is... Jay and Prex. And we are Will the Scry. Let's get it poppin', boy! Yeah, so what's what's really interesting about <clears throat> the character development that you'll see just from this scene is he talks about how he thinks he's being crazy and ridiculous for even thinking of the notion of using a notebook that will kill someone that's so outside of like societal norms, you know what I yeah, mean? Yeah. Um, and it's just interesting when you see how he like progresses the character. You see the smirk on his face too? Yeah. The human whose name in this notebook pretty lame not to mention twisted look at the girls they literally looked at him and he said oh my god yeah they, he's a very popular attractive dude at school this note will not take effect unless the writer has the person's face in their mind when writing his or her name therefore people sharing the same name will not be affected if the cause of death is written within 40 seconds of writing the person's name it will happen if the cause of death is not specified, the person will simply die of a heart attack. After writing the cause of death, details of the death should be written in the next 6 minutes and 40 seconds. Hmm. So depending on the person you have in mind, you can either kill them easily or painfully, huh? This is pretty detailed for a prank, I'll give them that. This dude still thinks it's a prank. What would you think? You gotta put yourself in, like, normal parameters, yeah. right? This just fell outside of a window at school? That's true. He's gonna test it out. He's gonna fucking kill someone. Uh oh. And then he's gonna realize, oh crap, it's real. Wait, on the off chance someone really dies, would that make me a murderer? Uh yeah. <laughs> That's yeah, exactly right. what that would it's do. It's completely impossible. <laughs> the same assailant who attacked six people at a busy shopping district in Shinjuku yesterday has struck again, taking eight people hostage at this daycare center. His captives include both children and teachers. Okay, he's a genius for that one. Write <laughs> it down, brother. Write it down, brother. A 
heart attack in 40 seconds? We'll see. At the present time, Udo Jigahama is done. One can only hope for a quick resolution to this situation. Ah, he's gonna get a quick resolution, all right. Looks like the notebook doesn't work. Oh well, I didn't expect it to anyway. Wait, we're seeing something here. Uh -huh. Besides movement at the front entrance. The hostages are coming out, and they all look to be unharmed. The special forces are taking action. They're moving in. We don't know if the suspect's been arrested. Huh? Yes? Okay, we now have confirmation. The suspect has been found dead inside. I repeat, the suspect <laughs> Yo! is now dead. dead. Hold on, what was his name? I... Kuro... I, I don't even know what he said. I can't even repeat it. Well, according to statements from the hostages, the suspect just suddenly collapsed. Hi! It's already 6.30, you know. Don't you have cram school tonight? Not now, Mom! I just killed someone! <laughs> <laughs> it works! It works! It's I swear, Mom, it works! I'm out! I'm gonna go change to change the world! Time. In which case, it should probably be another criminal. But if he's too well known, that'll be a problem. If he dies, there's a good possibility the news of his death will be covered up. Yeah, but I can't do that. Pseudo. Can't. Maybe I should try killing him. Oh! Oh, you better chill out! Definitely avoid killing people I know. And again. Does it even really matter? I mean, would anyone really care if a guy like him was to disappear one day? Sweet. Looks like we'll be hanging at the arcade after Damn it! Why is my mom so useless? Let's <laughs> 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 actually start looking around. I <laughs> wonder if you'd be doing society a favor by getting rid of <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Taco stinky butthole? <laughs> Yo, better chill. Every intermission, they they re, like reveal new rules about the the book. Now then, <laughs> yo, I can't get enough of this dude saying. You headed somewhere, are you? Hate to tell you, but our whole world looks like this. <laughs> yeah, the human world. What? what? His face looks like he just constantly had the nut of a light. <laughs> like forever. Just eternal jizznation. He, uh, <laughs> fucking, like. I wasn't expecting you home so early. Yeah. Hi, Mom. Day. Here. Goodness, number one again. These are the highest scores you've had. Yeah, I guess. I'm going to study in my room, so. The shit is like. As you wish. Amazing to any parent's right. standards, but to him. Do you want anything at all, dear? You can ask for whatever you like. No, I'm fine, Mom. Thanks, though. He has a new prize. Yeah, I was gonna say he's got a new reward God, system, Lord. killing people. Ooh. Look how many people he's killed. <laughs> Jeez, already. Yep. Episode one. <sighs> What's wrong with this? Dude? <laughs> You've taken quite a liking to it. There he goes. No reason to act surprised. I am the Shinigami Ryuk. Know what I found is right, he was waiting for him. It didn't take me long. And now that I've witnessed the proof of its power, I only feel more confident in what I'm gonna do. 
That's interesting. I certainly wasn't expecting this. Several Death Notes have made their way into the human world in the past, but you're the first to have written this many names. Look at how many people you've killed in only five days. Most are reluctant to write this much. I've already prepared myself, Ryuk. I used the notebook even though I knew it belonged to a Shinigami. And now that Shinigami has come. So what'll happen to me? You're here to take my soul, right? Huh? What do you mean? Is that some fantasy you humans came up with? I'm not gonna do anything to you. <sighs> Let's just say this. You will feel the fear and pain known only to humans who've used the notebook. And when it's your time to die, it will fall on me to write your name in my death note. Be warned, any human who's used a death note can neither go to heaven nor hell for eternity. That's all. He already fucked himself then. Yeah. Now you have something to look forward to after you die. Uh-oh. Light? It'll be all right. Answer it. That notebook you found originally belonged to me. And since you're now using it, you are the only one who's able to see me. And of course, my voice can only be heard by you. In other words, the Death Note is the bond between Light, the human, and Ryuk, the Shinigami. That's just like Venom. Mm -hmm. Mm. Yeah, I'm... I just have one more question I want to ask you. Why was I chosen for this? Hey, are you even listening? <laughs> <laughs> like, nah, bro, I'm grubbing. <laughs> Apples in the human world are worth the trip. What's the best way to describe these? You see? Just answer my question. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't choose you. Don't you see? This is all just an accident. You actually thought you were chosen because you're so smart or something? Don't be so vain. It just happened to fall around here, and you just happened to pick it up. I was going to say, he wasn't chosen at all. He was just looking that's out the window. That's why I wrote the instructions mm -hmm. in English, the most popular language in the human world. Then why did you drop it in the first place? You even wrote down specific instructions. So don't try to tell me this was an accident. You're asking me why? I did it because I was bored. You were bored? That is some good the entertainment. The truth Gami haven't got much mm -hmm. to do these days. Most of the time, Clearly, I'm just look at what he's already got to witness. Mm -hmm. you take the anyway, I'm surprised at how many names you've written. But I want to know why you only wrote the cause of death for that guy who was hit by the truck. If you don't write down the cause of death, the victim dies of a heart attack. And that's probably the best thing about the death note, Ryuk. Huh? You see, I've already exhausted the list of the world's major criminals. And eventually, I'm going to get rid of them all. What's the point of doing that? It's only a matter of time before people figure out that these criminals are being eliminated by someone. I want the world to know of my existence. That there's someone out there passing righteous judgment on the wicked. Ooh, he likes that. What are you trying to achieve by passing judgment Hold on, hold on. Pause this real quick. <laughs> Why do you care? So, basically what I got from that uh, yeah. is that he wants everyone to die of a heart attack so that everyone starts dying the same way and people get suspicious and then try and find out how why all these people are dying of a heart attack and then they find out it's him. Yes, but not... He doesn't obviously want to get caught because then he yeah. would stop. But he wants the world to know that there's someone looking out for the greater people, the greater purpose. They're just going to think it's God. You oh. are hitting the plot line already. <laughs> this dude wants to be God and he wants to be known and seen as God. Oh boy. You're hitting the plot line. <laughs> oh boy. All right, let's go. <laughs> because I've been bored too. There's something about the Death Note itself that makes humans want to try it out at least once curiosity i killed them both i really i killed two men those were human lives it, it won't be overlooked besides who am i to pass judgment on others a couple days ago uh, yeah right mm -hmm. and now he no, got too comfortable no, wait, maybe i'm wrong this is exactly what i've been mm -hmm. thinking about lately this world is rotting and those who are making it rot deserve to die 
Someone has to do it, so why not me? Even if it means sacrificing my own mind and soul, it's worth it. Because the world can't go on like this. I wonder, what if someone else had picked up this notebook? Is there anyone out there other than me who'd be willing to eliminate the vermin from the world? If I don't do it, then who will? That's just it, there's no one. But I can do it. In fact, I'm the only one who can. See, now the problem is that the different <laughs> people think other diff different people think different people are vermin. Mm-hmm. Oh, there you go, it's going to town. Oh, no. With the music. Oh, never. Look at them getting, this is them getting all sucked off. Busting the biggest nuts. <laughs> oh, oh. Just twitching, collapsing. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, nutty. What's crazy about this show is there's like no other show that can make you like feel the impact of someone swiping his pen. Like, look at this shit. At first, I wrote the names of the worst criminals I could think of. Like, I was cleaning up the world one name at a time. So that eventually, no one will ever do anything evil again. You got like Al Capone in that bitch. Guilty ones who deserve to be punished for their crimes die of Escobar. The people who are less guilty and still make trouble for others will slowly be erased through disease and accidental death. Then, and only then, the world will start moving in the right direction. So he has people It'll dying from like a year from now of disease. By people who I've judged Jeez. to be honest, kind, and hardworking. But if you did that, it would make you the only bad person left. Huh? I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm a hard-working honor student who's considered to be one of Japan's best and brightest. Yeah, but now you're fucking killing people. And I... I will become the god of this new world. Oh. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> Called it. Just as I thought, humans are so interesting. Oh no, this can't go well at all, dude. <laughs> This fucking guy's got the biggest fucking schlong of all time now. He's killed a couple people. He's like, my balls are bigger than fucking the world. Thank you for tuning in. I am Kirk D. Cam. This is... Jay and Prex. And we are Will Describe.